So we write for and then two parentheses. And the first thing we do is we initialize a variable we're going to be counting the amount of loops we use. That will be an integer. Traditionally, we call that integer i. And we'll set that equal to zero. We separate this with the next bit through using a semicolon. The next part is going to be the condition. So as long as this condition is true, the loop will keep on going. Usually we compare the i variable that we just made to a different number. And in our case, that will be our doors dot length. So however long the doors array is, that's how many times we're going to loop through whatever code we're going to create here. Then another semicolon. And then the last bit we need is the incrementer. Usually this is just i++, plus plus, meaning that i increments by one. Then we put on two brackets and we put in the code that needs to loop within those brackets.